Good job. Welcome to the clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. I want to start getting, like, the cool clothes. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Okay. Now for your safe word. Safe word? Afterlife. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky can I ask? looking for an Evelyn Parker she work here hmm give me a moment Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Huh. I'm sorry. Did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu. Let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef. Point blank. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Meaning, Meaning you go in as a customer. Keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close. Okay, far. do we want we'll Angel or Sky? Game. Hmm. Angel or Sky? Mm -mm. Thinking Angel looks good. I couldn't have chosen better Timothy. myself. Now for There's the no Timothy, and you'll venture into the clouds. Don't want to pay. <laughs> there you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Angel awaits you in booth six. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Okay. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Clouds is Go eat a dick, new. Johnny. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. So rude. Ah, let me in. <laughs> He's just sitting there. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> that was terrifying. <laughs> He just sit in there. He paid to just sit there. <laughs> What's with the delay? Plah. <laughs> this shit's funny. 
Is that dude just in the corner? Are you inspired on Can I help? It doesn't. See. Oh. Jeez. Can't do anything in here. That dude in the corner. Sharing it. Oh, okay. Is just on the floor. Can I buy? What is this? Munchie. Thank you. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. All right. Valerie. I'm Angel. Your Angel. It's V. Just V. Only people I know real well get to use my real name. But we'll get to know each other well in no time, honey. Sure, why not? Do what you do best. I know that you're dying. How do you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. That's why you're here. Look around. Tell me what you see. There's something in the mirrors way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not going to analyze you. I won't play any tricks. My sole aim is to fulfill your greatest need. Listen, I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details, minor ones. Like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? How can you change what has already happened? Got only one right question now. The one I asked. Where's Evelyn Parker? Why'd the manager say she didn't work here anymore? When was she last here? You know anything? These are questions to which you'll find the answers on your own. What do you mean, happened? You know something I don't? What happened to you? What you keep inside and never reveal to anyone? And that is? Come now. You know. Trusted someone and they fucked me over. The end. But you don't expect any good of people. Not anymore, I don't. You wish to leave something behind. A piece of yourself. That's why this all began. You wish to be remembered. Wasn't even that long ago. 
I was out to grab everything, and then, well, it all happened. Feels like that person wasn't even me. Still, if I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote would do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts, and that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just some stranger's voice in my own body, yapping away. Mm, no longer part of the world. You will still have an impact there. So you believe death is not the end after all. Reassuring. I think I might just be afraid. So I imagined these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. If what I saw before is any indication, I... You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, uh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me. Without me. I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never ending. Ever transforming. Not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V. Never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn. Okay? This is not what I paid for. <laughs> Thanks for this. I... I don't want to go out there. No one ever does. But eventually, we all must. Afterlife. What? What happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? W were you not satisfied? Should I have not done that? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. Go. Please, just go. You gotta help me, please. I'm no threat, and she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. Look, I barely knew her, and I have no clue where she is. Nobody came looking for her. Nothing out of the ordinary happened? There was an incident with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. Tom, who's he? Friend of Evelyn's. Wasn't a free moment they weren't together. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Shh. Don't ask for me again. Ever. I'm sorry. Thank you.
but it would be much better, Rio. I would eat those thighs. What do you mean, real? She's all ones and zeros. Do you mean I can ask her to do anything? Literally anything? Ask? It's not about asking, man. You just gotta be programmed. As establishments fuck sideways go, this one takes the whole damn pie. <laughs> hear that? At least I would hear no laments about pain. It hurt. It hurt. It's a hologram. What's so hard to get? Let me have my fantasies. Not like you know how to hack it, so why don't we just shut up and enjoy the show? <sighs> I have received a message. Save the game. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog! I'm taking it up with you, here, now! You got any idea who I am? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Okay, I'm assuming... I think Second I need is for to VIP to... customers only. Okay. May I see your credentials? the car no got a car you go upstairs Thing, whatever stands to fuck me up the quickest. Our you deaths. better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Okay. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure your VIP card checks out? Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. I don't think I have enough. Osaka or Oslo? Which was it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Well, it shows me those options when I do have them. Where can I find this Woodman? 
Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman. Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Thank you. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Whoa, no clients allowed in here. Well, dear, close the door on the way out, would ya? As you can see, I'm very busy. Hmm, very busy indeed. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you can do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Don't have time for your games. Need to know where Evelyn is. We're running a skin circus here, in case you haven't noticed. 
not a missing persons bureau. Let me guess, you played with the doll once or twice and now you want to run off into the sunset. Go down to reception, they'll find your soulmate 2.0 in even fewer seconds than that. Ay, ay, ay. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her bill or bow before. But go on. I'm listening. Oh, well. Can't say I didn't try playing nice. Better think real hard where you want to take this. Because you're really starting to piss me off. Look, we could settle this without anyone getting hurt. Why make this any harder than it needs to be? Should ask yourself that. Listen, you fucking stump. You are a real piece of work with your feet up on the desk, you know that? You think you're the first asshole who's tried to blow me off? Why don't you just blow me? How's that? I could also pop your head like a balloon with my bare hands. Doubt you want to feel me try and prove that I can. Ah, uh, pissing myself already. Bare hands. Well, aren't you the queen of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or scour his cop? That just might work. All right. You right there? Does that mean I have a weapon now? Hold up. Ooh. All right. Anything in here? Can't go through here. No. Get more info? How? Oh, I can do this. Uh, Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toys wet dream. Mm. Oh, shit. Sorry, man. Hmm. Uh, Dull Vita. Something spooked them. Right there, see that? 2 a.m. They hauled every last security man to the club. Looks like they called Tiger Claws for backup, too. Just fuck. No, let me jump. No, no, I'm sorry. Fuck. Okay. I don't know if I, I think I missed the shotgun. Or they just drunk. 
Leave the clouds, okay. So it means I have to again. Someone's here. Sorry. Take that. Tiger Claw's moonlight is peeping toms. Always got eyes on their dolls. Know what goes on in these booths. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist. Coming a mile away. Had a hunch? Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying? Oh, there's loads of people. Something spooked them. Right there, see that? 2 a.m., they hauled every last security man to the club. Looks like they called Tiger Claws for backup, too. Sorry, I'm sorry. <coughs> Fuck me. <coughs> Because it's in... Yeah? Yes. Looks familiar. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. Crumpled like a tissue. Yes. Must have been here a while. Anything else? No, not take it. We take it. I guess not. Whatever. Okay, 
something up. Oh, that's the, uh, the dude I spoke to. Okay. <laughs> 